One of the fascinating things about Marjorie Taylor Greene, and we talked about this in literature originally, is that the more outlandish and insane and like out there she gets, the more she seems to be rewarded for it in this life. Now, the thing about us, we also know these things, uh, earthquake. Um, we also know that these things don't last forever. So uh, one of the things that we've watched is Marjorie Taylor Greene make this Rhinum's wave of, you know, being Captain Crazy Pants, uh, this wave that has lifted her up. It won't last forever. This year, she will reach the pinnacle or peak of her power, whatever it's going to be in this lifetime, and it will be immediately followed by a very um, karmic measurement of what she's earned in this lifetime. So uh, the further up she goes, the further down she's going to fall, and they're going to happen one right behind the other. So watch this year as she goes up in power, um, and then before the year's over, maybe into like next year, uh, early next year, she's going to make a fast descent like a plane making a nosedive to the ground. So for those of you who are watching this, Queen of the Crazies, like, you know, be concerned, but don't be alarmed. It won't last forever. But we definitely want to pay attention because, because the further up she rises and the more expensive she's becoming, the more financial support she's getting from people who want you to be poor, broke, tired, and desperate. Okay, because believe me when I tell you, I don't care what color your skin is, you're not their friend. You're literally just a little pawn on a chessboard to be used and thrown away because we can always make more poor people. 